Shabbat Shalom, Perception and Reality. A poll was done in the United Kingdom a few years ago asking how many Jews there are in the world and how big is the state of Israel. The average answer was that there are 50 million Jews in the world and that Israel is the same size as the UK. Of course, in reality, there are only about 15 million Jews today, fewer than there were before the Holocaust, and Israel is less than one-tenth the size of the UK. In this week's Parsha, we read the First Fruits Declaration, which we're familiar with because we recite it during the Passover Seder as well. It begins with the words, Arami Oved Avi, Vayered Mitzrayma, Vayagar Sham Bimtei Me'at, Vayisham Legoi Gadol. My father was a wandering Aramean who went down to Egypt and dwelled there in small numbers and became a numerous nation. Rabbi Yaakov Yitzhak Trunk from Kutna teaches that this verse explains anti-Semitism, that those people who hate Jews don't perceive reality. Even though we are small in number, they perceive us as being a numerous nation. And not just numerous, but plotting something nefarious and seeking to dominate the world. Within each anti-Semitic claim, there is a grain of truth that is twisted and distorted. We are a small nation, but we do, quote-unquote, punch above our weight, so to speak. But not enough in a nefarious way, but actually in a positive way. As Jews, we seek to improve the world, not dominate it. And thus you see Jews doing amazing things that improve the world for everyone, from science to medicine to engineering to the arts and many more. So we do have an outsized influence for our small numbers, but it's for good, not for bad. It's only the anti-Semites' hatred that doesn't allow them to see that reality. I hope to see you this Shabbat at TRZ, Friday night, 7.30 p.m., and Saturday morning at 9 a.m., and Saturday evening at 8 p.m. for Selichot. Shabbat Shalom and Shana Tovah.